90 Day Fiancé star Larissa Dos Santos Lima has been steadily making headlines lately between rumors she's getting deported and her move to Colorado, but what fans really can't stop talking about is her shocking new look. Sources claim the Brazilian bombshell dropped a whopping 72k for a number of cosmetic surgeries and we're gonna give you all the details of her extreme makeover. Because now Larissa looks like a completely different person since we were first introduced to her on the show. Larissa Dos Santos Lima hails from Brazil and we met her on season 6 of TLC's 90 Day Fiance when she was quickly engaged to Colt Johnson from Las Vegas. I can't survive here. Honey, I need you to stop, okay? And when I say quick, I mean days after meeting one another. After 11 days total, he proposed. They were married in 2018 with the marriage full of drama lasting only about 6 months. Larissa also picked up some domestic violence charges on the way to the divorce. At the time of this recording, Larissa is 34 years old and has a different man Eric which I'm sure you know if you follow the show. She also has two children of her own but they aren't on the series as they stay in Brazil with her family. Weird, I know. But because she has had kids in the past, it was only another reason for for Larissa to go under the knife and get some things altered. Fast forward to more recent times and a newer season of 90 Day Fiance and Larissa is a whole new person. Looks wise anyways. The reality star got a multitude of surgeries and enhancements recently to reveal a Kylie Jenner inspired makeover and once she was satisfied with her physical appearance, she started an OnlyFans account. Larissa also collaborated with the webcam app Cam Soda and did an hour long lingerie show for them making a record breaking 6 figure collection. The show brought in 100k for the site and Larissa's performance received 10 times the viewership the platform usually receives. So I guess, in a way, Larissa's pricey transformation is paying off. What's going on guys and girls, my name is Kara and this series we've titled Before and After. We're going to be looking at 90 Day Fiance star Larissa Dos Santos Lima and her shocking transformation, including all the work she got done and how much she's changed. I've done other celebrity transformation videos on the likes of Mia Khalifa and Charlie D'Amelio, I will link to some at the end. Be sure to like, hit subscribe and ring that bell for notifications. As always, if there's anyone else you want a before and after on, let me know in the comments down below. Follow me over on Instagram to chat and let's get Get into this video. Larissa has been open about her love for plastic surgery as much as she has about her hate for ex-husband Colty. It took the reality show star barely 6 months after her divorce to first break up, then patch up and then ask boyfriend Eric to foot the bills for her pricey procedures. But what was Larissa working with before all of this? If you watched the earlier seasons and from when Larissa was still with Colt, you could see just how different she looked. Prior to surgery, Larissa had a larger nose and while it suited her face, she thought it was too big. She said her stomach and breasts changed a lot after having kids, which also made her self-conscious and probably why she rarely showed off those areas. She started glamming herself up while still with Colt, first with her hair getting some extensions and a new hairstyle. After calling it quits with him, Larissa altered her looks a little bit more and focused on herself. She lost 25 pounds and was flooded with compliments about her new figure. Besides hitting the gym and eating well, Larissa admitted to some other enhancements. She started getting Botox and fillers and said, Heather's done my lips, cheeks, nose, smile line and jawline, which is already enough to switch up your face. In July of last year, Larissa got 10 vials of Sculpture filler to achieve a fuller butt as well. But this was only the beginning. Now Larissa has drastically changed her appearance, apparently borrowing money from her man Eric, as well as money she saved up from the app Cameo to spend a whopping $72,000 on a Kylie Jenner inspired look. And she's almost unrecognizable. Let's break it down. Larissa started off with two huge procedures we saw in the series, a boob job and a nose job, which likely would have cost around 25 to 30k. Let's look at her face changes. Larissa's nose job I think changed her look the most drastically, which is usually the case after a rhinoplasty. Her new nose is sleek, small and pretty much perfect. So I can see why she's happy with the results. In addition to the major procedures, which came to a total of 5, Larissa also had laser facials, fillers and Botox done, which cost about 22k alone. With these, she would have had to keep refilling them probably twice a year at least to maintain her desired look. As I mentioned, Larissa gets her lips filled to get that plump look, as well as her cheeks, chin and more. Although Larissa has a totally new face, her body is even more shocking if you can believe it. Big boobs, small waist, big lips, and they started to feel, it's so pretty. 
<laughs> At the same time as her nose job, Larissa also got a breast enhancement, which she's wanted for a long time. This was back in February before the pandemic hit, and I hear her silicone implants took her from a 34A cup size to a 34 double D. Larissa went big, as in getting double the size of an average implant. And that's pretty obvious. In August, Larissa went back for more surgeries as an early birthday present. She got all of the work done by Dr. Lane Smith in Vegas, who we also saw on the show. For the second round of surgeries, Larissa underwent a tummy tuck and liposuction on her abs and waist, with Dr. Smith removing nearly three pounds of fat from her hips and a couple more pounds from her waist. Some of the fat ended up in her butt, transferring over one pound from her hips and waistline to each butt cheek, a procedure called a Brazilian butt lift. The full abdominoplasty with abdomen liposuction, flank liposuction, and fat transferred to her butt, plus her breast implants cost $50,000. The total amount of time under the knife was seven hours for the second round of surgeries last month. During this second surgery, Larissa even said she got more fillers and sculpture added to her booty. Larissa enjoyed the added bonus of going down two pant sizes after her liposuction and booty makeover. She said, I lose weight. I did the butt to make it bigger. I did Botox. I did my nose. I did my lips. I did my cheekbones. I did my chin. I am a new woman and I feel very happy. To go along with her new look, Larissa got her new long hair extensions as well. All in all, her Kylie Jenner inspired surgeries cost her 72k like I said. What do you guys think? Worth it or not? In addition to her makeover, Larissa also opened up about her diet and exercise habits to keep her new figure. She told Life & Style magazine that she started at 170 pounds and before the pandemic she would go to the gym 4 times a week for 60 minutes a day, doing cardio, arm, leg and stomach workouts. She had to take some time off exercising post surgery though as she's still recovering but planning to get back into it ASAP. Larissa also tried to avoid eating chocolate, bread, and milk, and focuses more on soups and salads and doesn't eat after 6 p.m. Larissa explained, For breakfast, I eat two eggs, two pieces of lean ham, whole grain toast with a small amount of real butter. For lunch, lean turkey or ham on whole grain bread with avocado, lettuce, and tomato. And for dinner, she usually has steak or chicken with salad and fruits and veggies as snacks. So there you have it, the complete transformation of Larissa Dos Santos Lima and all the work she's had done. The 90 Day Star explained she got her surgeries so close together so she didn't have to take too much time off for making money as an influencer, which after her cam soda thing makes sense. Larissa also revealed that it was essentially escorts at the Crazy Horse Gentleman Club in Las Vegas who inspired her to make an OnlyFans page. She plans to keep her 18 plus content sexy but more high end like Maxim and said about her account. Everything is tasteful and I'm embracing my new look. Well, let's hope Larissa doesn't turn into the next Farrah Abraham from Teen Mom. Anyways, I'm gonna wrap things up here, but I would love to know what you guys think about Larissa's shocking makeover. Yay or nay? Are those implants too big? Be sure to let me know down in the comments as well as who else you'd like to see a before and after on. If you want to chat more, you can hit me up on Instagram. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye!